Hello everybody, this is GTA News and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to double clutch on PC. Now I know in the past I've done a video on how to double clutch on PS4 with a hand cam and today I will also be showing you guys how to do it on PC with a hand cam. I know not many tutorials on how to double clutch on GTA Online show uh, the hands on the device they're using to play with. So, <clears throat> my last tutorial on how to do this on PS4 got, like, immaculate support. So, uh, as soon as I swapped to PC, I haven't really thought about it, but I will actually show you guys how to double clutch on PC. Because, um, it is tricky if you don't know how, and it's the same concept as a PS4, just, of course, you have keys. So. Let me go ahead and show you guys uh, how to do this. So the car that I'm using right now is the Slagen GT, I believe. Yeah, the Benefactor Slagen GT. You can get it off of Legendary Motorsports for roughly 1.3 million. And um, the reason why I use this vehicle for double clutching is because it's one of the best. Um, when I say that, I mean it gets a really good start, it accelerates a lot, and it has a visual representation when I try to show you guys how to double clutch. So it's perfect for this video, hence why I'm showing it. And of course, I'm not using a mod menu. Um, I do have a mod menu, but I'm not using it right now. So this is all real. This is 100% real. You can try it for yourself. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to teach you basically what you're looking for is a sound. Whenever you're driving and it shifts up, you want to identify that. So I'm going to go ahead and show you uh, exactly what I'm talking about. Right there. Go ahead and show you guys. Just listen for whenever the sound goes from high rev back to low rev. That's whenever your vehicle is shifting gears. Right there. Okay. So whenever you hear that uh, that gear about to shift up, that's your key point to start your double clutch. And now that I've showed you what you're looking for, I'm going to show you the right way to double clutch. Alright. Here we go. Watch my hands here. Hold down W to start driving. And once you hear it right about to shift up, you're going to let go. And for a split second, you're going to tap S, which should be your reverse, and space, which is your emergency brake, at the same time. So it's going to be basically holding it down and you let go and tap it and go right back on gas. Not like that, because what I just showed you was a bit sloppy, but it's going to be like this, just like that. So let's go ahead and let me show you guys what I'm talking about. Oh, see I messed up too. Try this again. Just like that. You heard all that high revving and you've seen the tire marks on the ground? That is how you can tell if you pulled off your double clutch successfully. So if you go ahead and come over here, I'll go ahead and slow down both my hand camera in a replay and the vehicle in a replay at the same time so you can see exactly what I'm doing and how to do it. Just like that. That is how you double clutch on PC edition of GTA 5 Online. If you guys would like me to make more videos like this that can be helpful to you guys, because there are a lot more tips and tricks for driving and speed boost, uh, brake boost, horn boost, all that stuff, let me know down in the comments below. And if you do want to help me out, I would really appreciate it if you click that subscribe button. I'm very close to 3,000 subscribers. And for that, I will make a special video dedicated to all of my subscribers. Possibly some merch if you guys are interested. I don't really know if you guys are. No, I mean, like, I know that I don't care for other people's merch, but I think it's a cool concept. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like and comment down below the next video idea and what it should be, or something if you'd like to see. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.